Hello YouTube, this is Dawn from Dare to Be Creative and I am here with week number seven, I think, six, seven, something like that, off of the three dye killer kit with Port Spice. So make sure you check out Port Spice's channel. She is the queen of hosting collabs and this collab we are supposed to use three dyes, three different dyes on a completed project, whatever your choice is. And you need to kill a paper pad, two of them. So this is one of the paper pads that I have that I was trying to kill, Weak and Neutral. And it was one of my cheap ones that I got from Ollie's. It was $2.99, I got it for $2.69 because I had 15% off. So that's a nice tip if you have an Ollie's, it's Feast of Famine. They may or may not have them, but check there periodically. Um, they do have paper pads, usually DCWB is $3 or less. They have Mombi and they have um, Colorbach. They're the ones that I've seen there quite frequently. Anyway, <clears throat> haven't seen any in a while though. But this is one of my paper pads that I thought would be a challenge for me because it's just a little bit more outside of my range. It's more neutral colors and it's more masculine, I would say. But anyway, so I um, used this. And what I did was I got this uh, in a haul. I showed this, the Spellbinders Pop-Ups dye from TM Tuesday morning for $9.99. And this came with seven pieces. So this is a uh, cuts out like a six by six piece to make this step part so i just cut my sheets of paper i got seven sheets of paper cut it in half you know six by twelve and i cut the, the die pot out and all the little accessories with it so i didn't have enough to make two flowers I mean, just one big and one little but not two of each one of those so anyway i just made seven they're all the same i just positioned around the um the flowers and the crown a little differently in different positions but they're the same and so they're your non-traditional happy birthday cards but I thought it was fun so this is the first one and again these are step cards that just says happy birthday and that's the location where I put the crown and the flowers and they are embossed as you can see so I thought it was pretty nice and this one And this one. So I'm gonna just move them around to different locations. I really wish I had maybe like extra four hours. You're gonna knock over my camera. You bumped it. Another one. And these are all, of course, Dude, on the inside. Outside. Yeah, people are outside. Mm -hmm. There's no kid outside. I kind of like the different colors, you know, the unexpected, you know, non-bright colors for the birthdays. So there are the seven, just different locations for the crown and for the flowers. But that was my um, project for the week. I used up, so I used up seven of those and I'm going to use the other half of these sheets of paper to make cards with the other pop-up die set that I got from um, Tuesday morning. Bill's binders die set. So anyway, please check out the links below and I'm sure you can try to plot your dies and to think about using more than one die on a project. And um, have fun, take care, like and subscribe. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.